So here's another Gen Z app called Retro, R-T-R-O. Um, it's a new social media app for brands, creators, and consumers. Uh, it's a new female founded social media app. Retro mission is to return to a time when social was simply focused on sharing real content and keeping up with friends and family. Retro connects brands, creators, and people in a more positive environment that uh, designed to keep you engaged with your community. Is the first social media app to divide its experience in two parts. On one side, you can keep up with your friends in circles, and on the other, you can go to Retro TV to see content from creators and brands in their own space. So yeah, as I understand, uh, let's just go through the app. Here is the app. As I understand, you know, it's like combination of WhatsApp groups and Telegram channels or like, like messenger broadcasting channels. So here you have these groups, which are called circles. And these are basically chat groups, which you would have like on WhatsApp uh, or, you know, f uh, groups on Facebook Messenger, just not like individual chats, but just like groups of people. And then you can just create your own circle. You can just give circle name here. And you can invite your friends to that circle. Uh, you uh, Yeah, you can just tap invite. And then, uh, yeah, just invite friends, copy in white code, and then you can just send it, whatever. And that's like the invitation link here, you can just see. Uh, so that's basically the idea. Uh, you can see circle details, of course, you can just edit it here, notification, you can just add more people. You can block people from here. So imagine you have some uh, friends at your school, your college or some travel friends, some you know, sports team, work pals, whatever. So then you can just go and create your own circle uh, and then just invite those people. Then in the second tab, you have TV channels, which are basically like broadcasting channels, what they call them in Messenger. So here you just have, you know, different, uh, different influencers, and then they just share their content, but it's not like a group chat. So you can't message here. You can only only react, copy message, uh, uh, and then for example, something like that. You can just react here. You can leave, leave circle. You can see notifications and that's uh, basically the idea. And then you can just join all these different TV channels. So if you heard about Telegram app, that's basically the idea of these broadcasting channels that you just go here and then you just read all these messages from uh, from this feed. Um, and also like Facebook, I think, just working on this broadcasting feature. So yeah, it's getting quite popular. So you kind of uh, getting all the news, but you are getting them in, in your messenger environment instead of like going to Twitter where everyone uh, uh, where you just, you know, pushing all these messages to everyone here, you just have like a broadcast and then you can create your own broadcast and people can subscribe to it. And there are different categories, uh, vibes, family, kids, fun, sports, music, travel. Uh, then you can also just join here. It's very niche app at the moment. I think they're just releasing the beta so you can see like there are 80 members or something, but it's a cool idea. Then you just have your profile. You can just edit your name details. If you want to, you can delete your account. This will permanently delete your account. You cannot undo this action. So then, yeah, then you just have your account like that. And then you have your AI chatbot. Uh, similar as you would have in Snapchat, my AI chatbot. So something like that. Uh, and then just have your messages. And uh, so, yeah, that's basically the idea of the app. Uh, so here, just search for something like retro. So, yeah, it's uh, you, it was just released. So give it a try. It, it got some press in TechCrunch and some other tech uh, magazines. Um, so give it a try. It's like a Gen Z social media app. A lot of people are looking for some, you know, alternatives for Instagram, Messenger, WhatsApp, Twitter, far away from this, you know, uh, social media monopolies. So maybe this is the next app. Give it a try.